Hi everybody, Molly here with Fort Bliss Art and Hobby. Today we're going to make intergalactic soap uh, to honor Star Wars. So may the Force be with you. Good morning everyone. Today we're going to be making an intergalactic soap. We're using one pound of a crystal soap base. Uh, this is already ready for you. Just going to cut it up and microwave it. Uh, we have a purple and a blue to make our intergalactic fun stuff within the soap. Um, I've got a soap mold here. You can use multiple things. You can use a Tupperware container. Uh, you can use the bottom of a milk carton. Uh, anything you want to, to use. It is soap so it does wash out of everything very easily. Uh, I do have two measuring cups today. I've got this guy and I've got this guy. So the reasoning behind this is because we're going to melt it all down in one, but then we're going to separate it out into two different containers. So I can have one container that has purple in it and the other container that has blue in it. Now we'll be using Galactic Skies as our fragrance today. You'll receive a pipette in your kit um, that has the fragrance already in it. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to chop down my soap base so that we can get it melted down and ready to go. So join me back here in just a few seconds. everyone we've got everything melted down here um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to separate these out I'm going to try to do half and half in each one um, don't know if it'll work or not but hey it's okay if there's a little more blue or a little more purple um, looks like it's right around one cup if you want to split it in half so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and open the mica that you received in your kit. It's got blue mica in it. I'm going to go ahead and stick that in one of them. And then I'm going to take the purple and I'm going to put it in the second container. So now we'll have two containers that we're going to use for when we pour our soap. So from here you just want to go in and mix it up the best that you can. Um, this might take a few seconds. Again, like I said, you can use anything you want really for a soap mold as long as it can withstand the heat. Um, you can use any type of silicone mold. So if you have molds for doing some um, cakes or cookies or, you know, the little ones you use for chocolates, all of that will work. Okay, so you can see here we've got this really pretty blue going on. Um really pretty can't wait to see this in the soap so now I'm just going to move over to the purple and just do the same thing just stir it up really well as you can see that's going to be really gorgeous also perfect for an intergalactic soap okay so from here what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add fragrance I'm going to put about it doesn't matter you can put it all in one you can split it up I'm just going to split it up and put half in, in one and half in the other. It doesn't really matter because it's all going into the same bar of soap. So let's go ahead and Okay, so I've got that ready. Now, I'm going to go ahead and move some of my stuff out of the way here. Give us a little more counter space so you can see what I'm doing. So I'm just going to use this silicone soap mold. I've got my purple and my blue ready to go. So from here, I'm just going to kind of pour from the corner. Oh, that's okay. I'm going to pour from the corner. And you'll see, as it goes, it's going to spread out into like little swirls, which is really cool. See how that's coming around? So what you do is just pour one color in the corner and then go back and pour the other 
until you fill your mold up the way um, you want it or the height that you or not the height I'm sorry how full you want the mold itself for the bar of soap so it's going to be really cool to see how this one turns out once it's all dried out and ready to use um, so the next one I'm going to start with the blue first and then I'm going to come in with the purple just kind of do the same thing over and over it's okay if you get a little sloppy I mean, these are your personal bars of soap and also they clean up really well because it is soap so it makes this so fun so I'm just going to kind of keep going here I think you'll get about three bars of soap out of the one pound maybe four just depends upon how what type of mold you're using and how full you're making it. So this is going to be my last one here. Of that in there and there you have it I will be back in a few moments to show you what the these soaps look like when I pop them out of the mold see you in a few seconds all right everyone here we are with our hardened soap um, I'm just gonna flip it over and push these out see how beautiful they look Some of them are more blue, some of them are more purple. You can just peel these extra pieces off. But as you're using this soap, you'll see the different intergalactic effect we want. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Oh, there's a good one. You can see they look, they're so fun. And you never know what you're going to get. All right, well, enjoy your May the 4th, and may the force be with you. Have an awesome day.